Hank. El Simpo. I've never liked this guy. Um, I, I think every single season he's probably been my least favourite Mayan. It'd be oh. diff- it'd, it'd be hard to pinpoint a season where he wasn't. Well, Lobo's beat him. All right. M- my least favourite original. My Mayan original member. gangster. Lobo shit, right? I'm not counting Lobo. <laughs> Fuck Lobo. No, but for me, Hank's a, a terrible guy. No, it's weird. You go on Twitter and you see people like tweeting this guy. It's like, oh, I don't know what I'm going to do now on Wednesday night. Not seeing, um, what's his name? Steve Lomas or something? Or Steve, his real name? Uh, well, let's just call him Hank. Uh, like, I don't, I don't know what, idea. I don't know how I'm going to live now. Frankie I'm, Loyal. Frankie Loyal. I don't know how I'm going to live on Wednesday nights not seeing Frankie Loyal on my TV screen. I know it's how like, I'm going to live. I mean, first of all, you barely got to see him anyway because he didn't really feature much and... Second of all, like, why the fuck would you miss this guy? I mean, he was a shit character. No, I mean, is, is, the biggest story arc he had was holding two bottles of beer while he watched the Angel steal his girl. No, he's essentially a simp. Like, to me, I always portray a sergeant arms, you know, a fucking strong guy, right? And, like, I, I just couldn't imagine Tig and Sons, like, if he, if he wanted to go out with someone and, like, a younger member who's, like, 15 years younger than him, just hoovers it off him and he just fucking... He Did just you challenge him to a fight or he'd be getting involved? He's he's like, just, and people may think that, that I, that's a weird fighting for me, but to me it's just weak. He just looks like a fucking better meal day in this. And then how am I supposed to... Sergeant Arn's supposed to be like the fucking strong member of the char. The guy who's going to kill people for the prize. Yeah, this guy, it's like... This guy, this guy is, is pish. It's like when Sobel turns up and, he, he uses, and Clay, Clay warns Sobel here. If I tell him to kill you, Hank he is will. the sort of guy to put straws in bottles of beer. Where we fucking umbrella. Hank should have been president. Uh, Hank should have been <laughs> prospect. Uh, he shouldn't even be a prospect. He should be fucking clean and well, sick at the toilets. No, but like he's supposed to be like Bishop's number, essentially Bishop's number one because Sergeant at Arms is like kind of your main man. I know you've got a VP, but I think you could definitely argue you're closer to your Sergeant at Arms. You give the order and they. They take out the whatever you want, and like you just never, I never got that feeling, with Hank. No, but Hank never even confronted the angel with the nails thing, right? Look, look, looking sons for like Clay. Well, half, let's look half and shit. I mean, that's the prospect, right? And then like you've got the scene in the boxing match, like half sack reacts, he's fucking battering the guy. What's Hank done? Hank's done nothing. Well, let's look past the whole nails thing. What's he done outside of that? Nothing. Cried to his mum. Gonna get you a room, my. I mean, I guess at the very beginning of the season, I'm not, we're not only here talking season five, but he, he did, like, check out easy. He didn't do a good job, did he? Like, no, he didn't. But, uh, yeah, no, season five, we, we still had Hank trying to find his mum a place. He was it's, trying to sell his house. The dumb bastard thought Jess was the rat. Yeah, it's like, what the fuck? Come on, man. We didn't, we didn't even get to see this guy go physic creeper. Like, what the fuck were they doing? We, no, we seen the ending of it where he, he was there and then it just ended him walking away. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, could, could there not have been some important fucking stuff they were talking about that we didn't get to see? Like, what? why have that off screen? Why have him there not... No, but that's like... The so conversation it, was off screen, no, but him leaving was on screen. Could you imagine Sons like, oh, we need, we need, we need to go and um, visit Otto or something? And then, like, later, two, two minutes, like, five minutes later, they cut to the scene... And it's just, it's like the bell rings and Jack, gets, and Jack gets up and he shakes hands with all. I'll see you later, brother. And he 